within the next 15 minutes. To repeat. What do I need to do to be ready for work? All right, they're actually here. morning so I don't know if you've ever taken me to this place before but we're using a slightly different door these days um, hopefully that helps If I do, I wish I could make this phone call, but I'm pretty sure it's 8.30 or 9 before this place that I really need to call opens. I don't want to talk about what issues I found out were there yesterday, but I called both people I have numbers for at the place I need to find out what's going on at, and neither of them was available, so... At the very least, I'm going there this weekend to get to the bottom of it, but I don't want to wait that long. Hopefully I remember to call this afternoon or tomorrow at the latest. Of course, if I can't get anything but a people's voicemails, I won't have any choice but to wait until Saturday, but I'm going to do everything possible to get answers earlier. But there's nothing I can do about it now. Even if I get to work at like 7.45, there's nothing I can do about it. I have a habit of worrying about things. Maybe I should just wait until there's an actual problem with this... with this location. She says, uh, she's like, uh, just, do you want to wait for a problem? I probably should, just because when you call customer service, they're like, well, was there a problem? I'm thinking, no, I'm trying to avoid problems. Well. Maybe I should wait for there to be a problem. But maybe I should stop thinking about it like that because as soon as I say, well, maybe I should wait for there to be a problem, something will come up. Just stop it, stop it, stop it. I am inherently a negative person and I'm trying to change that. I can't go to, from always negative to always positive necessarily, but I could become more positive. That I could work on being more positive than I naturally am. And I think we're here, so... I'm just... I have to count on you guys' agency to get me home today. I hope the person picking me up to go home can figure it out. I mean, especially if I put my co-workers on the alert that, hey, this is the guys that you're looking for. Hopefully they'll get to the right place, but if they don't... I mean, the woman at the front desk is, ex is prepared to uh, 
set people straight if, they, if she needs to. All right, perfect, thank you. This is why we switched to this door, because just like that, I am at my workstation. Didn't need to ask anybody for help, didn't have to have anyone do any kind of extra work trying to get me here. I was able to just do it myself. And sure enough, it's 7, 7.40 in the morning. <laughs> I'm going to put some finishing touches on what I'm going to eat and then get started already because between the fact that I wasn't here on Monday because of the weather and the fact that my window going home is 2 to 2.30 which means I might have to leave or clock out or get ready to leave as early as 1.45 I feel like it might be a good idea to just start work as soon as possible. And on that note, since I don't vlog while I'm working, for a couple of reasons. Number one, it would be boring sitting here listening to me work. <laughs> well, I guess that's the main reason. But anyway, since I don't vlog while I'm working, I'm going to stop this and see what the rest of this vlog ends up sounding like. <laughs> and then edit this together and decide if I want to bother to put it up on YouTube or not. My work vlogs are so lame, that's why they never show up on YouTube. Well, I may or may not start early. I don't have to. Maybe it's nice to just have some time at work where you don't have to worry about working. I don't know. We'll see. It's going to be closer to 8.30 when I get started, but that's all right. And again, I'll probably see you at the end of the day because that's probably going to be when there's going to be anything to say. All right, I'm off work, waiting for my ride, hoping it gets here soon, hoping they come to the right place. I could try making this phone call. But I just don't feel good about being occupied with a phone call and then they show up. I'll do it when I'm on the vehicle or when I get home. Anytime now, you guys, like, seriously.
28 p.m. Thursday. Slack. Dictate. Thank you, period. I'm in the vehicle now, period. Have a good weekend, period. Inserted, thank you. I'm in the vehicle now. Have a good weekend. Send. Button. Send. Send. I Saturday, but I want to talk to somebody now. I'm not willing to wait that long. After what just happened, I just tried to make a cash app payment and it wouldn't go through. And I want to know what happened to my account that that's, that's gone down. <laughs> I know there was a, but what else happened that it declined? I assume it happened because there wasn't the funds, but what am I missing? <laughs> Yeah, if you put that in the system on Monday, how long does it usually take? Shouldn't it be there by now? Alright, have a good day. Thanks. Bye. Well, at least now I know why. 
what happened yesterday happened. Not that I'm any happier about it, but I understand it. Uh, this just... On the one hand, I shouldn't be surprised, but on the other... Uh, well, live and learn, I guess. I don't know. It'll be alright. It'll be alright. I know you guys have no idea what the hell I'm talking about, but... <laughs> Let's just call it... More money issues. I always call them and they say, Well, here's how it happened. I'm like, I'm like okay, well... Well, anyway... I'll talk to you when I get home. If there's anything to say. Well, there's something to say, even if it's just, thanks for listening. <sighs> okay, it's almost four o'clock. I finally got home. <laughs> That's longer than I thought I would have to spend riding around, but it is to be expected on this door-to-door -door transit service sometimes. It doesn't happen very often, but sometimes it does, especially when you're that kind of commute. I mean, what would take you 20 minutes if you're going straight there can easily take an hour to an hour and a half when you're not going straight home or straight to your destination. So that's why that took so long. And with me being home, I'm going to end this vlog and see if I decide to put it up or do what I do with so many workday vlogs and just say, screw it. Thank you for listening, watching, whatever you'd call what you just did. <laughs> check out Ira, check out Shipped, check out the stuff in the description below, and you'll hear from me in the next video. Bye.